Hi, this is Gleb Bachmodek and I want to show you how to use start server and test to start your application before you run tests and then shut down the application when the tests are done. So imagine I have an application, I can start it and then I have added Cypress and I want to run Cypress using those commands. I'll go to the terminal and I'll add start server and test as a dev dependency. Great. Now I have a couple scripts. So I start my application using start. So if I want to run the application and then open Cypress, I can say start test. Before, because my application is using start by default, I don't even have to say start command. I can go to the next thing. When you start the application, you want to wait for port 3000 in this case on localhost to respond before you start Cypress. So in this case, I want to run open command. So let's see how it works. Yarn dev. Great. Started the development server. Open localhost 3000. It responds. And after it does that, it runs Cypress in the GUI mode. And now it starts. I have written the test already. So I can run the test. Excellent. Localhost 3000 is responding and the expected text appears in the iframe. Great. If I close Cypress, it exits and it shuts down the server as well. Now, if I want to run the test in headless mode, I will replace React Script Test with Cypress Run. So in this case, if I want to run end-to-end -to -end test, I'll say start test. It will use by default the start npm command, so I don't have to mention it again. Just wait for port 3000, and after that, it will run the test command by default. It will run Cypress in headless mode. Let's try it out. npm run ide. Again, starts the application. The browser starts. And then runs Cypress run, as you can see here. The test finishes successfully, everything is shut down. So that's how you use start, server, and test.